It's the kind of thing that sends shivers down your spine. Checking your home security footage and discovering that something strange and unexplainable is happening within the walls of your own house. That's exactly what one Reddit user experienced when they reviewed their security footage and saw a series of unexplained events that left them wondering if their house was haunted. The lights start flickering strangely enough with the door shutting by itself. With series of events, the user is left shocked and terrified. What aggressive spirit might be haunting his place? Security footage is supposed to give us a sense of security, a feeling of safety in our own homes. But what happens when that footage captures something that cannot be explained? That's exactly what happened to one Reddit user who reviewed their security footage only to discover something strange dark, ominous mist swirling towards the ceiling. Some say it could be a bug, but what's your genuine opinion? Mansions have long been associated with elegance and luxury, but for some, they are also hotbeds of paranormal activity. That's certainly the case for the McRaven Mansion, which has been the subject of numerous ghost stories and unexplained events over the years. One such event was captured on security footage and shared on Reddit. Oh, come on, open it back up, Mary. You can do it. Go, girl. You got this. We got a lot of energy for you tonight. Please open it. So, Carrie Brewer. As the camera rolls, a dressing table's door suddenly swings open, as if pushed by some unseen force. Was it the work of a ghostly presence, eager to make its presence known? Ashmore Estates is a place layered in history and, as a result, many hauntings. It has previously functioned as an asylum, poor farm, and nursing home, but today sits empty and abandoned. Team of Amy Script goes to investigate the paranormal activity that plagues the old haunted asylum and caught some of the creepiest activities. <laughs> you want me to stay? That was weird. Yeah. Don't leave me, and then as we leave, it's like backward, like go back. Like stay in here. Do you like me or Jared? Amy or Jared, you want to stay? <gasps> Alright guys, I'm going to call Amy. Yeah, are you all right? I thought I was and then the REM pole was going off. <laughs> um, I heard a weird noise as well when all that was happening, like a <laughs> right now. Can you say something to us? Are you there, Joe? Very cold right here. Is it okay that I'm here? I don't mean you any harm. What was that? I don't know. I thought I heard something, but it wasn't in my room. It wasn't in my room. Loud tapping sounds and movements were heard with a strange growl from the device. Oh, that was creepy. Who's around? Our friend Ashley told us a story about someone that ran through this corridor and really gave her a scare. Can you tell us about that? 
I just heard a noise down here. Same. Can you tell us what that noise is? This can be heard. This is cool as we thought we had earlier heard this same noise while inside that very room while performing a ghost to Vox session. Could this simply be debris falling from the roof in a consistent fashion or was it perhaps caused by something else? Lastly, strange tapping sound was heard again with a pebble falling in one of the rooms where a camera was set. Some places are forever stained by the horrific events that took place within their walls, and the Axe Murder Hotel is one such place, once the site of a gruesome murder spree that left eight people dead. Haunting the Haunted recently made their way to the hotel armed with all manner of equipment designed to detect the presence of spirits. Hello, Pete, are you here? Have you been cursed and been... You, you're cursed and trapped here now for killing the two women. Pete, are you here? You can find dates. Freezing cold in there, man. Oh, look at the desk. That's, yeah. that's cool, man. Look at that, guys. Twice throughout their exploration, a strange disembodied voice was heard. A brave Japanese explorer ventured deep into the forest, hoping to capture evidence of the spirit's presence inside one of the most haunted forests with rumors of roaming child. Strange footsteps were heard, and by the end they only got louder, so much so that the investigator called it quits. Twin Paranormal investigate one of the most haunted houses in Virginia City, the Mackay Mansion. Recently, a demonic entity has taken control of the building and reports of paranormal activity are getting more intense. They revisit this location in search of answers, and what they find is something they will remember forever. Remember us from three years ago. We would like to have a conversation. What the f was that? Oh my god, did you just f hear that? Yeah. We were reset it. If you can touch it again real quick, just to show us that that was you. We would really appreciate that. We just want to make sure it's not our device. Hopefully you're comfortable enough to come down these stairs when I'm kind of close to the device. I promise I'm not going to harm anybody. Okay, now let go, please. Ooh. It sounded like somebody had closed the dresser or opened it or something. Whoa! Dude, what instantly. What is going on? Yeah, we hear you. Can somebody come and make this music go off? The device that's here on the rocking chair? Please? I can speak through this. Whoa, the what? device! 
We yes. have never heard that before. Yes. That's crazy. Yes, you can. That's the device that you can speak through. You can talk to us. That way. Strange knockings were noticed, then their Rin Pot alarm goes off. But the creepiest part is when the spirit starts communicating back through the device. Trust us because you said not to worry about the attachment. Mm -hmm. You know, come out here, show yourself. Like a confirmation almost, like, okay, okay, you know what I'm saying? Interesting. Mr. Mackey, are you around still? Last time we were here, you had quite the conversation with Ryan. I don't know if you remember me. Absolutely. Whoa! No way, dude. Guys, this is incredible. What is going on? Hey, we're coming into this room here. We're going to sit in a circle. We're going to channel. We're going to sit on this floor in a circle. We're going to channel our energy for you. Is that you over there? Can you come and look at this? That is incredible. Yo. Whoa, dude. I told you. I was just talking. I said, do you know what that sound like? I didn't even pay attention that it was a horse. No. I was... Dude, I was literally just going to say, if you move that horse, touch the rim pod. Oh. Let go. The present spirit starts answering them, and the rim pod alarm goes off in the most strangest sound ever. At the top of the steps right there. Whoever's here with us, Shadow Man or Kevin or Mr. Mackey or the little kids, now's your chance. We're all the way on the other side. We want to prove that that wasn't us who knocked it down. Whoa. Thank you for that. We have all these toys here for the kids. Tap one of them. They'll start to light up. Use your energy. Show us, please. Where are you? Guys, hmm. did you hear the squeak again? I did. That was right there. The squeak was right there. Do you hear it? What the f you hear it? Seriously? It's in this room. What the f Lastly, strange squeaking was heard again. This place, without a doubt, is very haunted. That's it for today. Subscribe Top 5 Ghost for more scary content.